What up, everyone? Upbeat music. We're going to start this stream off with a top five commentary. Well, all right, yo, let's watch that one more time. Top five. We're going to do this with commentary this time. That's me talking all about this. I always forgot to move the camera this time over here to this monitor, which is, I, I got a whole new setup. Kind of a new setup. A little bit of addition there. So I got to remember, I got to start looking at this camera here. Anyway, we got me here in early duck. Get a three killing spree. Actually, the thing was like a six kill. There's kill number five, and we'll end it there. Boom. Hit it with Spazzy Chuck on Zakaria Pinball. Yeah. Oh, okay. So See I how like her hands down right now? The day. He plays during the okay, daytime at various hours and various games. Need to get up. And get here's up him there. playing uh, some pinball. So at the very top of the screen, there's a little lady with her hand down. So like right this. now, if, if I get the ball down, trying to get the ball up there. And then there we go. She got the ball up there. And now we go. That was kind of cool cool play so yeah it does not have to be call of duty you can submit any kind of game here to watch and uh every month i try to put out a top five for you guys here in Bard county boom here's john's recap boom there he goes so they for the round win on that one good job john play savage coming in number two on apex it's kids king with the wingman all the way across town that's got to be 100 yards out and another one. This is the third kill. He kills the whole squad there and he saves his buddy. Check that out. And then number one spot, Alpha by Tech here, coming in with a crazy helicopter kill so there in the to shop. get a balance. I'm gonna crack the shop into that shop. Oh! And we're like that, about to also jump into Warzone. But first. But first, let's talk about who we are, what we are, and all that good stuff. We are the best resource for residents and visitors of Florida Space Coast to find events and connect gamers together. Our mission is to unite gamers in, through community events and business curation. Yes, if you've ever been to our Facebook, you'll see all about that. You'll also see that our new streaming schedule for April is going to be Sundays, 4 p.m., which is now till about 8 p.m. Tuesdays at 7.30 p.m. till 10. The reason why we had switched it to Sunday was uh, we had intended that league games are going to be weekly and that they would be played out on Sunday. But since we only had one person sign up, we're not going to be doing the league. Still having a tournament here next month, so stay tuned for news on that. Ask some more about our Facebook here real quick. You can see that we've shared a ton of stuff, so you always want to go to our Facebook to see and be caught up with all the things that are going on. Uh, this past Saturday, Dogs of War Gaming out in Palm Bay, they hosted a huge Blood Bowl tournament, and you need to check out their Facebook for more information on that, because I don't, I don't know stuff about Blood, Blood Bowl. Uh, if you have not been out to Arcade Monsters in Palm Bay, you can go there and grab a cold, nice beverage of the alcohol variety, and then check out some pinball games they got, or arcade games, and other cool things they got going on there. Ready, Set Game and the Brevard Gaming Lounge always have Magic the Gathering cards and the latest from there, so check them out. If you haven't checked out our YouTube channel, please do. We showed you guys the top five that we posted up earlier last week. And ta-da! Awesome. So thank you guys for all the submissions. April submissions are now open. You can check out this website here, which is 321gaming.com slash Brevard Top 5. And uh, there's a submission form here at the bottom. Put your gamer tag, your game, submission link, and then let us know which thing you're playing on, which thing, which console, or if you're on PC, maybe even mobile. I don't know. Again, we don't discriminate the game. It can be a board game. It could be, you know, a cool thing. Try to keep it under the 30-second mark and uh, see yourself a top five spot. What else we got going on? Oh, yeah, if you have not been to our website, please head over to the calendar section. Again, we, we try to pull all the stuff from Facebook. If there's other stuff aside from Facebook. Next weekend, is that next weekend, I think? This coming up weekend, Saturday, we got GamerCon out at Rubik's Cafe. Uh, they're doing cosplay, video games, card games. They're, they're kind of doing it all. So check it out. I wouldn't pass it by that they're going to also have live music. So check out that coming up on the 17th. What else we got going on? What else we got going on? I don't think there is a whole much more. To... Oh, yeah. Rick Shea. He did an amazing interview. 
check that out. It was uh, from Nerd Culture. They have it there on their YouTube channel. If you're not familiar who Rick Shea is, I'm not either, but you can get familiar with him <laughs> through this YouTube. I do know that he runs the famous Faces and Funnies out in the Melbourne area, or West Melbourne area. I'm not sure which actual, what the technicality is there, but it's out there, uh, off 192, and um, I, th I think they're starting to do in-store purchases now if not you they they're always live auctioning on their facebook oh yeah uh if you haven't been to the website also lately you notice i had a new section there content creators in Vivard, from the facebook gamers to the twitch streamers and the youtube gaming guys so check out the website click on the link for all that stuff uh till then uh, i think it's time to just jump right into some Warzone.